Hi, this is David from Asdam Business Analytics. Today I'm going to show you how to generate a payment through Kariba and how, we, how it is easy and super intuitive uh, and only will take you about one to two minutes. Uh, you are currently having a problem of managing your payments from different several banks that causes you to manage several sets of security credentials and physical tokens for uh, multiple users and for different banks. While each e-banking system varies greatly and thus navigation approval limits and uh, workflows operations are inconsistent across your banks, this creates a problem from audit perspective and increases the likelihood of fraud. The multiple e-banking systems prevent the treasurer from standardizing payments limits and workflows across the organization. And this makes uh, it so difficult for unauthorized. Uh, it, this doesn't make it uh, difficult for uh, for unauthor unauthorized users to hack your uh, system. So through Kariba, today we are going to demonstrate to you how you can uh, easily make the payment. Uh, this can be applied across all your banks, regions, and users. You can standardize this, this process. To initiate a payment, you have more than three options. You can automatically generate the payment from uh, settlement such as financial transactions module and uh, from for loan interest FX settlements. Uh, you can also import from external sources like ERP and uh, accounts payable system. Uh, you can uh, manually, manually, you can manually in, enter the payment uh, via pre-established uh, or free-form templates, or also you can upload from uh, Excel format, CSV format. For so, uh, the initiator of the payment will, will will come here to the payment module and add a new payment. So I have more than one options. Uh, you can uh, make a blank payment where you can see all the elements of the payments are uh, blank and you will need to fill each one of them. You have another option is to create a template for your most recurring payments so you don't have uh, to fill ev every uh, element of the payment not only for the efficiency and the increase of workflow, uh, the process, the speed of the workflow, but also for, for control and security perspective. So you can lock down uh, those elements. For example, we can see here a template to who have already prepared. So as you see, you can find all the elements of the payments are already filled in. The initiator, the payer, uh, the PE, the accounts that will be debited, uh, the issuing bank of the payment, uh, the vendors that will receive the transaction, uh, the vendor's account ID. Uh, all you need to do is to come here in the instructions tab and add the amount. So as we said, you can uh, lock down all these details so that the initiator can, can't, uh, can't uh, exchange the, the values in these elements. So you have the, the control on, on your permanent payment process. Additionally, you can see the GL impact of this payment, uh, the debit and the credit size. Uh, after this payment will be done. So you can also know and generate those uh, GL entries to your ERP. So all you have to do is to save. And you can find here that the payment is initiated and uh, registered. Uh, the payment now will go to the next authority level in, the, in your organization uh, for approval. Uh, so so the approval or the manager will, will just come here to his dashboard and he will can see his payment uh, available here so he can approve it, uh, it with other payments.
also he can request the, for modification from, from the initiator. He can uh, request for deletion. You can see more, more details of the payment here in the site. And even if there is an invoice or something like that, he invoice can be attached to the payment. Finally, I just want to say that Kariba ha have up to nine level of approvals, so it can uh, 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 comply with uh, most complicated workflows uh, with four level of uh, levels of acknowledgements to ensure that your payment is received by the bank and the bank executed it. Thank you and see you in another videos. Thank you.